Hello everyone! I have a different type of video for you today. Happy October! Happy spooky season! I'm so excited. So today, well, you know what, before we get into this, if you're new to my channel, hi, how are you? It's good to meet you. If you're returning, hello, welcome back. It is so great to see you again. If you guys like my content, please like, share, hit that subscribe. I really, really appreciate it. We're growing nicely. It's so great to see. So thank you to every single one of you for helping my channel grow, for watching my videos, etc. You are super, super appreciated. I cannot thank you enough. And I'm just so grateful, uh, truly. It's been amazing. All right. Um, if you guys want to book a personal tarot reading with me, you can do so on the website that I will address below, of course. So let's just get into it because I'm excited and I don't want to wait anymore. So we're going to do a little bit of an unboxing here today. Something a little bit different. It is not a tarot deck. It is not an oracle deck, but it is a crystal order. Yes, it is. So I, um, I, well, let's be honest. I do several orders with, uh, a Canadian crystal, uh, seller here, um, called the happy bat crystal shop. She is on Instagram and she is amazing. Her name's Megan. She's got really great prices and all sorts of things. Um, affordability is amazing. She does um, payment plans and open boxes and things. So anyway, oh, see the Happy Bat Crystal Shop. So be sure to check her out on Instagram. There is, oh, and Facebook. There is the information there. So I'm not gonna lie you guys, I already kind of went through and um, I opened everything out of this packaging because she wraps everything so goddamn well. Like it takes forever. And I didn't want to sit here on camera and like cut through all of these things for like an hour while we try and open these. So, so we have a little thank you here from the Happy Bat. Dear Randy, we hope you have an awesome spooky season. Enjoy these magical goodies. Love the bat. Oh, I love that. I love it. Gonna put that over there. Okay, oh, where do we start? Ooh, so we have this beautiful point here that Megan, I think, just threw in. Which is absolutely beautiful. Quartz. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna move this off to the side. <laughs> And you know, we're gonna start with my favorite piece uh, that I ordered. And it's gorgeous and it's stunning. And it is this beautiful, beautiful dragon. I hope you can see him. Can we just, I mean, the carving on him is so goddamn fabulous. Like look at the detailing of his teeth and his little, his ear, his wing. He's just, look at that little face. Isn't he just adorable? But so that is my all time favorite. Um, he's dark green. You can see a little bit of red running through him. So I believe this is bloodstone. Look at, look at that. Look at this over here. Like it's just it's stunning. The carving is top freaking notch. So I couldn't wait. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to show him first because I, I was just so excited. So, ooh, all right. All right, so next we have this beautiful heart. So you guys, I, I got several different hearts here. And now, for those of you who don't know, in my day job, I, um, I do reflexology, crystal healing, uh, Reiki, things of that nature. And um, these are beautiful. They're not too heavy. They're really nice shape. They're great for using with the crystal healing lying on um, the body. All right. As well as, let me get a tarot deck. I will show you what else I do with these. <laughs> This is still in your way. Is that in your way? Jeez, oh, I don't know. I lots of times will always have my deck sitting out 
with a crystal on top of them to uh, continue to charge the deck with crystal energy when I'm not using them. So move that to the side. We have that one. Oh, geez, I'm just dropping some oh, garbage. <laughs> You guys, forgive me. This is my first unboxing of crystals and it's a bit, it's a bit much. Okay, so next we have this very cool point tower. I think that's some appetite in there, but it's in some sort of matrix. Like, look how cool that is. I just thought it was very unique, very different looking, and I very, very much enjoy it. And again, these are also great for setting on top of your um, decks or, and I will show this part next. She has these tiny sacred geometry grids, okay? This is for crystal gridding. And this little tower fits perfectly. And then you can, of course, add other little grid pieces. So it is absolutely perfect for that. And they're nice and small, very easy to travel with too. So love that, love it, love it, love it. Okay, and then I got a couple of these, all right? They're just, they're amethyst hearts. Again, perfect for crystal healing, perfect to charge your decks with. Um, a lot of times when I um, travel with my decks as well, there's always a crystal something like this in the um, tarot bags that I travel with as well. So perfect for so many different reasons. Is that not cool? Like look at that cut in there. Very, very, very cool. I love it so much. This is just gonna be a video of me like talking about how much I love all of this stuff. So, <laughs> all right. So perfect for spooky season. We have a cute little black cat totem. I don't know if you can see him here. Again, the carving is beautiful. Look at that cute little face. I like that um, his one ear is rounded and his other one's pointed. It just gives it so much character. It's so, so cute. I'm hoping that you're seeing this properly. But he's just so freaking adorable. Can we just? And of course, little black cat, perfect for spooky season. <laughs> Obviously. Okay, next. I, I was all about the like little carvings this time, you guys. I don't know. I was I was doing it over a course of months and I was just drawn. So we have an elephant totem now. With his little trunk up. So he's got some great good luck happening. Look at his, okay, can we just, look at his cute little tail, all right? Again, bloodstone. I have been very, very drawn to bloodstone lately. You'll see, I mean, I have my dragon, I have this guy, I think I have another thing in here that's bloodstone. Um, very grounding, right? Um, and I mean, 2020, I think we could all use grounding, right? Like, shit be going down. So, he is absolutely beautiful. Perfect for some grounding, some abundance, some healing work. And I just think he's absolutely beautiful. Feel free to look up the meaning of um, elephant totems. They're great luck. And uh, look up the properties of bloodstone because if you're looking for a great um, healing grounding stone, bloodstone is perfect, okay? It's one of my favorites. <laughs> And again, because it's Halloween season, well, let's be honest, I have him out all year. Um, we have this tiny, cute as a button. I don't know, if, I'm not too sure how to hold him so you see him properly, but um, this adorable little bat. Isn't he cute? This, I think he's obsidian, right? Great for protection. And of course the bat, great symbols for um, transformation, for rebirth. And he's absolutely amazing. I am a bat freak, always have been. I think they're beautiful. Love them to bits. Oh, let me know in the comments, you guys. 
so bats, a little side story here. Um, back in the day when I used to do theater all the time, we actually um, did a show in an old... Let me know if you want a story time. Basically, there's lots of ghost things that happened at this old theater that we had converted and there was a bat in there who used to hang out all the time and that's what he reminded me of. Anyway, let me know if you guys in this month of October would like some spooky story times because Lord knows I got them, okay? Um, another beautiful amethyst heart. Like, look at the cool, like, I don't know, like the lacing in there. Do you guys see that? Is the camera picking that up? I just think it's so pretty and it's just so deep, right? Like on the side here, I don't know if you can see that, but beautiful. I will be gritting with that one as well. Okay, again, because <laughs> he's just so fucking cute. But no, again, um, another carving. This time it's Crazy Lace Agate, which I don't usually have a lot of, but I think it's so cool. Can we just look at the, look at the detailing on this little guy here. Look at the lace in him. Look at his face. He's just freaking adorable, cute as a button. But I was just really, really drawn to him. I liked his colors, I liked his face. And I like bears too. Always have, I don't know why, because it wouldn't, I wouldn't think that it would be one of my go-tos and yet here it is. Okay, <laughs> here it is. Who knows what that's from? Anyway, props to you if you do. Again, here it is, another bloodstone, you guys. Can we just, beautiful bloodstone state, steak. <laughs> I'm tired, I guess, snake. But I mean, look at how coiled he is. He makes a perfect like infinity loop here. Look at the detailing on his face. Absolutely stunning. But again, the carving is beautiful. The character in this is just absolutely amazing. Like, look at that face. I just love it. I just freaking love it. Again, snakes are beautiful. Um, and again, feel free, you guys, if you're drawn to one of these, um, one of these carvings, I suggest you look up the meaning of the animal totem that you're like, oh, I really like that bear. I wonder what that means, you know? Um, it's very, very cool. All right, so my next bigger um, carving, and again, I think this might be a lace agate as well. I can't quite remember is this amazing raven skull carving. Can we just look at the coloring? I mean, look at this. How freaking cool. Look at the, t I mean, reminds me of Toucan Sam sort of from Fruit Loops, but like, I mean, look at, look at that tip. Look at the coloring. Look how that like lace kind of goes in and around. Isn't that stunningly beautiful? Oh, I just, I love it. I love it. It's beautiful. Oh, okay. that's all you're gonna hear me say is, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Oh, I know. Don't come for me in the comments. I realize it's probably super annoying. Okay, but I think this is my last one out of the way and just make sure yeah all right so the last piece you guys now I have tons of crystal skulls maybe one day I'll do a collection video let me know if you want to see them um because I've, I've got lots all right and they all have their own personalities but I mean here we go and again this is some sort of lace I get too but can we just I gotta focus Look at the detailing, look at the, 
at how that just fell naturally. I mean, I could just sit and stare at these lacings all goddamn day. Right? And it's very sturdy, actually. It's quite hefty. But that face. Look at, again, the detail of the carving. Look at the teeth. I mean, is he not stunning? I freaking love him. All the way around. Like, beautiful. Okay. That concludes my very I probably drew it out more than I had to but that was my crystal haul from the happy bat crystal shop this time let me know in the comments do you follow her on Instagram will you follow her on Instagram because you absolutely should this is so cool um, and I mean obviously right the best so here we go. That is it. That is my quick little haul of my crystals for this time. I'm sure if you guys like this video, I will do more in the future. Um, thank you so, so much for watching. Please do check out the happy bat on Instagram and Facebook. I thank you so, so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye.